In light of the news this week that megastar Beyonce and her husband Jay-Z are expecting twins, 7 Eyewitness News reporter Justin Moore decided today to find out just how common it is to have multiple pregnancies. Beyonce may be the queen bee who's pregnant with twins, but she has nothing on this new Buffalo mom, Melissa. She showed me what was labeled baby A, and I said, why is that labeled baby A? And she said, because there's two more. And then she showed me baby B and baby C, um, and I just, I think I just laid there and didn't speak for like 30 seconds. <laughs> that is right, Melissa Haberfield gave birth to triplets. She and her husband, Kevin, welcomed three baby girls, Peyton, Reese, and Mika at Sisters of Charity Hospital almost two weeks ago. Yeah, we have no frame three. of reference for what one baby would be like. No. So we just figured, what the heck, I'll just go big and have three. <laughs> These triplets came without any fertilization drugs, which doctors say is rare. Most common is the in vitro fertilization uh, when multiple embryos are implanted. Uh, but twins, like I said, are more common, even natural births. According to statistics, one out of every thousand births are twins. One out of every 10,000 births are triplets. Multiple births are coming among women over 30, African Americans and those with twins. Grammy winning artist Pharrell Williams' wife, Helen, recently gave birth to triplets as well. You know, maternal health, maternal age certainly plays a role in how the pregnancy goes. The Haberfield family says it's three and out. You know, we had kids when we were a little bit older and never have I ever been as vulnerable as I am right now with these little tykes. In Buffalo, Justin Moore, 7 Eyewitness News.